today we're going to be doing more of the Christmas IOD transfers. I had some of the larger ones that I didn't use last time and I thought it might be fun to do a few more of those home decor DIYs today. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start with this Lazy Susan. I picked this up at Hobby Lobby. It's in the Christmas section, believe it or not, and it's half off right now. So I have an idea for this with the transfers that I have that I bought from Iron Orchid Designs. Just going to give this a good wipe down here. So I have several of these transfers left, some of the larger ones. And I'm looking at these here and I'm thinking of using these around this tray. I'm gonna tear those off, but as I'm looking at these, I'm like, I'm like, oh, this Santa would look nice on here too. That would look good. So now I'm just gonna go through and just go through what's left of the transfers that I have. I did make another video before, and I can link that for you in the description box in case you want to see it. I have used some of these transfers already, but I'm just basically trying to decide which one I want to use. And it's going to be these right here. Now that I have the transfers arranged around the tray the way I want them, we're going to remove the backing and we're going to use the tool that came in the kit and we're just going to put the transfers on all around the tray. Here's how it looks when it's done, and here's how it looks styled up for you. So I had the urge to go to the Salvation Army after work to look for one of these. A little out of my way after work but I thought I just had this hunch that I wanted to find something like this and lo and behold I did so must have been kind of one of those God things where he's leading you yeah I believe that God leads us even for small stuff like this you know insignificant things like this yeah I found what just exactly what I was looking for so for three dollars so I think I'm going to do, let me find it, I think I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do the car on this. So, but I'm going to paint and I might, I don't know, I might add something else to it. I guess, that might be kind of fun. But I'm going to paint, but I'm trying to decide how I want to paint this. if I did like a car in the middle and then did like some of the, the ivy on either corner I'm thinking of doing that let's figure out what color I want to paint this do I want to paint it the green I was I don't know if I want to paint it the chateau I think I might want to paint it a green I, think I might want to go with my green we're going with the Waverly Celery color today. And this is something I have on hand and I'm just using one of those foam brushes to brush this 
paint on. I did end up doing two coats on this. It probably could have used a third one, but um, I decided to let it go after two. And then I had the idea to use my IOD mold and make these small little pieces here. And I made four of these, and I think we're gonna tuck these into the corners. Taking some tight bond, I'm just going to add that to the back of these and I'm going to glue these onto the corners of the edge of the tray here. After I do that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to repaint the frame and I'm going to paint the little, I guess you'd call these little medallions, little small medallions in the corners. I'm gonna paint these also. I decided that the old Christmas truck transfer was the best one to use on this tray. I think it goes nicely with the green and we're gonna add a finishing touch after I put the transfer on. I've had this tube of rub and buff for ever, a few months now, and I've been wanting to find a project to use it on, so that's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna go ahead and use the rub and buff on the little medallion pieces, and then we're gonna just kind of put it around the rest of the um, tray framing. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, put this on and then I'm gonna let it dry overnight. And I just realized that I rubbed this and I never buffed it. All right, I have these chalkboard tags. I believe these are Dollar Tree pieces. I've had these since last year, I think. I thought the Holly transfers would look really nice on here. So I had just raided my stash and I found these and I thought, okay, those two transfers will look real nice. So I just have to say, I just love these transfers. They are so easy to use and I just have so much fun using them and I'm not sponsored or anything. I will link below where I get mine, but um, I just love these. I think they're beautiful and just so much fun. And then I grabbed some ribbon that I have from my stash and I just really just tied it around the top. Tie it around the top and we're just gonna trim it up a little bit and I'll be done. And then another thing you can use these transfers for is for a gift wrap, wrapping paper, or here I'm just gonna take this little bag that I have and put it on here. And then that will make a nice little bag for somebody's Christmas gift this coming Christmas season. I'm not sure who yet, but I'll use it for somebody. If you've enjoyed this video, I would love it if you would like, leave a comment, subscribe if you'd like to see more, or share this video with somebody if you think they would enjoy it. Here are two more videos for you in case you're interested. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.